Hurricane Sally is still haunting area farmers, and now it is in the form of a pesky bug. Yeah, the beetle has moved on from thousands of down dead trees and are now chewing their way through live trees we rely on for holiday pies and side dishes. NBC 15's James Gordon with our story tonight from Baldwin County. Gary Underwood is one of the largest pecan farmers in Baldwin County. He's now spending a lot of time spraying pesticides. His number one enemy, this little critter, the piranhas longhorn beetle. It's never been a problem and now it's emerging and it's becoming more and more of a problem. The piranhas longhorn has always been around, a bug whose larva stays underground for seven years. And when the beetle does show up, it feeds off the roots of pine trees, which are the most abundant trees in our area. But when a storm like Hurricane Sally comes along. When you don't have the storms that take down the whole section of woods right by you, they're gonna stay over there where there's more trees, you know? The root systems on pecan trees in our area, like these seen here, are slowly being eaten by the piranhas longhorn. And for pecan farmers like Underwood, it comes after Hurricane Sally took down more than 600 of his trees. Even though he will have fewer pecans to harvest, he doesn't see the price of pecans being affected, mainly because other producers have stopped exporting the pecans to countries like China. Georgia, for probably five, six years, was planting a million trees a year. So when you're planting that many, uh, the few farmers that are here, we're not going to make a difference in the big scheme of things. The hope now is that the current hurricane season won't cause any further damage. In Baldwin County, James Gordon, NBC 15 News.